going to make two kinds of egg roll, one with chicken and one just vet vegetable. All right. This is called uh, bean tray, and I need four of this for like half for the chicken and half for the vegetable. Where do you get that? At the uh, Oriental store or a Korean supermarket. And I need to soak with warm water for 30 minutes. So we mix into the egg roll. It's like a bird's and, nest. Yeah, and, and uh, it's for, uh, and it is, uh, it will take for 30 minutes. And now I'm going to peel the uh, carrot. How many carrots do you need? And for two different kinds, I, I need two and a half pounds of uh, carrot and one bundle onion, green onion is for, um, it's for vegetable or egg roll. And then two of this onion, one for the chicken egg roll and one for, for the vegetable egg roll. That's it. Now I'm cutting. <laughs> <laughs> so you never used to make vegetarian egg rolls like 15 years ago, right? All uh, right. It's like because now, you know, your daughter, i.e. me, yeah. has all these friends who are vegetarians. Right. So I have to make it. I, I, don't, I don't make a vegetable egg roll. I know. It's, so it's, we, we did not request it. And you're so nice to do it. It's, well, my pleasure. <laughs> I actually think your vegetarian egg rolls are superb, though. Oh, I, I forgot one more thing. One more. One small has a cabbage for the uh, vegetable egg roll. So you have one bundle of scallions, one onion, and one cabbage. And um, how many carrots for the veggie? About a pound and a half. Three pounds total. Yeah, two, three pounds total. Gotcha. But if you were the beginner, you don't need to make all this because it's too much. You just buy one pound of chicken and uh, one bundle of the bean thread. Bean thread! And let the half pound of carrots. This is my suggestion. I think it's a pretty good suggestion. Unless you're having like a bachelorette party and you want to make a ton. Yes. This is for two different types of uh, egg roll. That's why I have a two pound and a half carrots. Now I have to peel the carrots. And then later I will put into the Food processor to chop the carrot. Sweet. Did you always have a food processor? I did bought my uh, six years ago. What did you do before the food processor? I chopped my hand. Take longer. That would take a lot longer for yeah. the egg rolls. Take a lot of longer. One drop on the floor. And now I need to peel it. Hey, that's a nice peeler. Thank you. I remember your old one is like skinny and tiny. Yeah, this one I went to a peeler day here with uh, Missy Cook's sister. Uh huh. And I uh, bought this. What were you doing in Philadelphia? We went to the Chinatown, buy some uh, barbecue duck. Whoa, did you go to Atlantic City? Uh, no. We don't have enough time. If you had time, would you want to go to Atlantic City? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I like the slot machine. Man, it's like there's a blade on one side. You see this block thing? You can go uh, cut the block, spark off. So how was your week, Mom? Good. I went. Oh, uh, Mrs. Uh, Turner came over on Sunday. Uh, Monday we went to Potomac Mill, we walked, uh -huh. and then we ate McDonald's. <laughs> Biscuits? Sausage with biscuits. Oh, like a, like a sausage egg McMuffin? Yes, and then uh, we went home, and then we make uh, Vietnamese uh, bánh lọc. We make like 100. Mom, you know your your show, a lot of people have been watching it on the internet. And uh, 
they thank me for, and they wanted me to thank you for um, sharing your cooking secrets. Oh, thank you. I'm glad to share um, my cooking. You're changing lives, Mom. Wow, those carrots look mighty fine. When did you get these ingredients? At the Korea and supermarket. Yesterday? Uh-huh. Wash everything, wash the onion, for the vegetable I throw. You know sometimes the uh, the onion, the sand, you know the sand, the dirt get into it. Mm -hmm. So I put the water in here and I try to... Uh, oh yeah, it's like... Yeah. It's like when you bite off the end of a Twizzler. Uh, actually, not really. No, no one. I just put this side, this side right there, and now we'll I'm deal gonna, with you later. Now I'm wondering what to wash the chicken. Uh, so how much chicken do you need? I have four and a half pound of chicken. So I make a lot of egg rolls. How long have you been making egg rolls for? For well, like twenty years. I mean, wash all this. Did you make up this recipe yourself, or did you learn it from someone? This one I make up by myself. I use chicken, some people use with pork, and I use with chicken. Later, I will put in the food processor and chop it up. How come you use chicken instead of pork? Okay, I like the chicken better. It's like the collateral. Yeah. It's, it's better for you. But you can use with pork, and you can mix with shrimp in there, or crab meat. You can add yes. Whatever you did, your taste. Uh, yes. no. Chicken has been washed. Now I cut the chicken. Take all the fat, excess fat out. Mm -hmm. like that. I don't want any fat in. So you remove all the fat first before you cut it? Alright. I just cut there uh, and then I cut like that. Uh, big chunk like that. Mm -hmm. And later I put, put in the... Uh, Food processor and the work. food processor does the work. Yeah, wow. So you are used to cook the I mean used to cut the chicken by hand really fine. Right. I think I remember that when I was little. Snoopy! What's going on, Snoopy? Hi! So how much time do you think the food processor saves you? One hour. And it saves your hands. Isn't technology great? Yes. Super. Do you ever think you could be a vegetarian, Mom? Um, yeah, I can. Really? Yeah. Wouldn't you miss pho? Pho. <laughs> <laughs> I miss the uh, chicken egg roll. What about McDonald's sausage egg McMuffins? Uh, I can go without it. All right, you finished cutting. Yeah. Wash my hand off with salt. Okay, now I put in the food processor. 